One of the most beloved restaurants in Louisville is on the market. The owner says he's ready to finally take a break. Dennis Tang spoke with the owner of Vietnam Kitchen, which has been a staple in Iroquois Manor for almost three decades. Vietnam Kitchen is closed until July 26 for vacation, but once they do reopen, its days could be numbered as the owner looks to finally retire after 28 years. On most days, except for Wednesdays, you can find Alex Lam behind his counter at Vietnam Kitchen, but those days could be numbered. We are getting old. <laughs> You could say Vietnam Kitchen, one of the most popular international restaurants in town, is the story of the American dream. Alex and his family came to Louisville as refugees from Vietnam in 1980. When we came over here, nothing but zero dollar, and we just work, 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 work. Alex and his family took English classes and worked to save up money and decided to open their restaurant after 13 years, hoping to introduce Vietnamese cuisine to the Louisville area. We try the best we can, if we're not, so we close the door. Alex says there were tough times along the way, but after 28 years, Vietnam Kitchen has become a staple in the Louisville community. He says it's thanks to the customers. We survive because we have the local people, you know, Louisville help us a lot. The restaurant has grown a lot over 28 years, but so have its owners, which is why Alex says it's time to move on. My wife, she worked a lot, with work many, uh, our in the kitchen by herself mostly, so and hurt her knees, you know, bad health, something like that. So that's why I don't want hurt herself. The ad listing Vietnam Kitchen for sale calls it a great opportunity to own a gold mine. It also offers the current owner will train new chef for six weeks and offers most of the current inventory. Alex hopes he can find a new owner who will continue the legacy he started almost three decades earlier. Well, I love Louisville. <laughs> I love Louisville City. I love it. Alex says once he does finally retire, he does plan on staying here in Louisville. After 28 years, this is his home. In Louisville, Janice Tang, WHAS 11 News.